family or friends along this morning or uh, anything like that, now is to give them a little nudge and say, if, if you would like to go forward, I'd love to go forward with you. Sometimes it's quite a hard decision to make, you know, publicly, you may not have been in this sort of environment before and not exactly know what's going to happen, but I can assure we're not going to embarrass anybody or anything like that. We just want you to acknowledge that you desire to have God in your life. We just want to pray with you and bless you. And uh, so if you have a friend, be sensitive, give them an nudge and say, man, I'll go down there with you if you'd like to go. I know that there's people here this morning and God is reaching out to you. And I know that. And if you roll, it says in the scripture, you know, if you draw near to God, God will draw near to you. And the moment you start moving towards the Lord, the Spirit of God just starts moving towards you. And, um, and so we're just going to sing this through one more time and just encourage you. Just come as we sing. Amen. Amen. Thank you, guys. Pray you'd be a witness that they're in the family. We take authority over 
any curses that may have been in the family lines, we break off the generational curses on the father's side of the family, we break them off the mother's side of the family, we break off those curses, we sever all of the cords, we sever the ties to the world, the ties to the past, we release them from all of those things this morning, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen? Amen. 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 Yeah. And some guys, I know there's friends here, come and pray and bless these guys. And uh, hey, before you go, church, um, pray, pray for the prayer meeting. <laughs> and um, just, just greet one another with a, with a hug and a blessing and a handshake. And,